Doing a couple shoulder presses here. Nice little warm up. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Carl here back with another episode and featuring this time around what is in my tech bag, which is just my normal school bag, but I am going to see yes in close to 24 hours. So I'm gonna be packing my luggage, heading on over, keeping you guys updated with all the tech that is coming out in 2016. These are the gadgets and accessories that I will be bringing with me on my sweet journey. The first piece of tech, of course, you will need to travel and get outside of your country is of course your passport. It's got a bit of tech built in, a small little chip that will let countries know who the heck you are. The second item that I never leave my house without, of course, is a camera, and I'm bringing with me my Panasonic GH4, which is now my B cam. I'm currently shooting with my new A7R2, but I love the Micro Four Third system. It's nice, small, and compact. The GH4 has an articulating screen so I can vlog with it, I can take photos, I can take video. This thing is a beast in such a small and affordable package. As I will be taking a ton of video footage as well as photos, I am taking 64 gigs of storage times by three as I'm currently recording with one. These things are so lightweight, SD cards are a must when traveling and you can always buy more if necessary. The next little piece of tech that I'm bringing with me is so simple and it's so easy to store in your bag. It is a simple pistol grip. You can attach this onto your GH4 or action camera, anything that has a tripod mount and not only with my GH4, but with this little guy, the Sony AS200V, which is the action cam that I'm gonna be bringing. It increases the stability of the shot just by having an extra point of contact. Don't underestimate this little piece of tech. It is so useful. And the action camera, as I said, that I'm bringing is the Sony AS200V, records at 1080p at 60 FPS, fully waterproof in this nice little case. I usually bring GoPros, but we will see what quality video I can get with this little action cam. The next piece of tech is all about relaxing, kicking back and playing some games when I've got some free time. Hopefully when I'm on the plane, got a couple hours to kill, I can play some Super Smash Bros. This is my Nintendo 3DS XL. And of course this is in the Link Between World bundle. This is in gold and black. It's got that nice Triforce and shows off my Zelda love. And the tablet of choice that I am bringing is the iPad Air 2. And I'm bringing this instead of my MacBook since I want to keep things light and I prefer this size over the iPad Pro, which I think is honestly too big for travel. This thing fits nice into my bag, is slim, and I won't really notice the weight. And my headphones of choice alongside of my Apple earbuds are the Sony MDR-1Rs. These are so comfortable, have some nice foam that fits over my head. My ears don't get sore after hours of listening to them. These provide nice, clear bass, clear sound, and I highly recommend these for a traveling set of headphones. And the next item is so vital in case you're running out of juice. This is the SoLove 20,000 mAh battery bank. It comes with two USB ports, charges via micro USB, has a nice little LCD counter to let you know how much juice you have left, and you can charge your phone six to seven times before it dies. Not to mention comes with this very sweet felt sleeve and you can store useful things like your passport. And of course, last but not least, the one piece of technology that no one likes to leave the house without is of course a smartphone. Mine of choice is the iPhone 6S plus 64 gigs in space gray. This thing has a sweet camera. The battery life will last all day and I don't need to be worried about it dying while I'm on the floors of CES, live tweeting and providing you guys coverage. Those were the tech gadgets or tech items that I like to travel with but it really depends on where I'm traveling to, who I'm traveling with, and if I want a heavy backpack or not. I usually like to travel nice and light, but if you guys have any other suggestions, make sure you leave them down below in the comments. I am heading to Vegas, as I said, in one day. I will keep you guys updated with all the tech that is coming out in 2016, so make sure you subscribe to the channel, smash that like button as it does help me out a bunch, and I will see everyone in Vegas. Peace.